Hey guys, so today is another one of those a day in the life of my bag. Today I'm using my um, Hobo B and I just wanted to take a minute to show you. My husband is going out to the box. Um, he will be out in the box for about a week. The box is like uh, military training and war games. There he goes. I love you. I love him so much. And I'm sitting here and he gave me a list of things that he wanted me to take care of while I'm gone. Um, mostly like uh, remembering to do certain things and it's okay. He's wondering why I'm still sitting here. Hold on, let's pull up to him. So I can show him that I'm not being weird or than normal. I need to get one of those I need to get one of those camera th I'm in a rental car right now and I don't have my camera thingy for when I'm driving so I need to get one for this car but anyway so my husband usually has no I keep my planner you guys know I keep my planner and that's how I remember to do everything but usually when he goes to the box uh, there's a couple things you know new things that he wants to remind me to do because I don't always remember. There he goes. Bye, honey. So, yes, I am driving on a military post while I'm looking at my phone, my camera, Psh, life. Well, anyway, so while he goes out to the box, I'm actually gonna be driving this rental car back to Houston in a couple days with my daughters, and we'll be picking up our regular car. We'll be picking up the Tesla. Um, we had to have an estimate done on some body work because we had a hit and run happen to us not that long ago. And the lady who hit us, her insurance is gonna be taking care of it, but we had to get the full estimate. Anywho, I have today with me my Hobo B, which is my ride and die girl. And um, so when we first got in the car, I pulled out wipes for my husband because he actually had to get under the hood of our regular car this morning, which uh, it's a, it's a beat up sort of uh, Toyota 4Runner and he, typically when he goes out to the box or when he goes out to training in the field or whatever, he brings that car so that we don't, you know, get our car messed up. But um, the starter went out on it. So we ordered a new starter and um, it's the wrong part, it's the wrong size. So I had to, he wanted me to put reminders down in my planner to drop off the uh, starter back at UPS and then I have to reorder the new part, or actually I have to go to AutoZone and pick up the new part for it. So, and then there's a whole bunch of other like random to-dos that he needed to remind me of. So while I, we were driving, of course I reached into my Hobo B and I've got my planner and of course he needed a wipe this morning. Um, what else did I use this morning? Of course pens, um, yeah. So I have some errands to run today with my girls. I also have a dentist appointment, so I'm gonna be taking you guys along so you can see a day in the life of my Jujubee Hobo Bee. So I hope you'll tune in, I hope you enjoy, and thanks okay. for watching. So already this morning, just being in the car with my husband, I have pulled out my planner um, and sticky notes. So you see right there, I keep sticky notes in here because I am forever, uh, I live and die by sticky notes, guys. I have, of course, used my friction pen, my um, uh, planner strap. What else have I used? Oh, yeah. I used my uh, small set piece that I'm using as my wallet because I had to show my ID to get back in the other side of the gate. Um, in here, I used the wipes because my husband's Humvee was, like, really, really, really dirty. It sat with the windows open overnight. And so it was full of dust and stuff on the on the driver, on the steering wheel. So I grabbed a wipe, and I was able to wipe that off for my husband. This is a piece of paper that I had to shove in here for when I uh, drive back to Houston this week regarding our rental. So I just put that in here. I actually need to put that in my planner. This notebook where I wrote down another list of stuff that he uh, wanted me to take care of. And I also gave him like four Clorox wipes so that he could wipe down the rest of the um, dust in his Humvee. So, and then of course there's my keys. Um, so that's what I've used so far this morning. And I will take you along with me the rest of the day and show you exactly what I use and how I use it. And um, 
So I hope this video will be helpful okay, to you. Okay, so second little trip of the day. I am meeting someone at a local place to exchange something that uh, they're purchasing from me. So they're purchasing this black planner. So I've got, this is just what it looks like right now. I've got my junk in it, my planner right here so I can log in the money and um, yeah. So we're gonna go do that real quick. And so that is the second ride that my hobo bee and stuff is coming with me today. So there you go. Okay, so I've just made the drug deal. I'm just kidding. So I know this is gonna be crazy all day to show you this, but I just wanna show you. So now I'm pulling out my Aaron Condren planner and I pulled out my wallet set piece and I put the money in here and now I'm just going to write down I'm, I'm keeping track of what I'm selling because I'm trying to buy my husband a really nice Father's Day gift so I'm keeping track of what I have sold and how much I sold it for so I can deposit that money in my bank because I'm really bad with finances like I am so horrible with money I just am numbers and money it just yeah I'm bad at it so just gonna grab my pen in here. Here's my pen. And um, I'm gonna log that in. And yeah. And then we have some other errands to do today as well. And so I will take you along for all that too. Okay, so we are on our way for the other part of our errands to run today with our day in the life of my Juju V Hobo Bee. There's my two littles, and here's my big and her super awesome, super toky. Be right back. And um before I get started going, as I've told you guys a million times before, I am so unbelievably forgetful, it's crazy. So I have my Erin Condren planner out, and because I can't look at my Erin Condren while I'm driving, um, see all that? I have to make a sticky note to write down exactly where I need to go and what I need to do, and then I put it on the outside of my planner so I don't have to open it to do it because otherwise I'll do like one or two things and I'll forget the other stuff that I had to do. So, of course my pen from my planner, uh, some to-do list sticky notes which are seriously adorable, uh, of course my Erin Condren and my babies. And traveling today since we're gonna be out for a few hours because we're gonna do some errands, we're gonna go get some frozen yogurt at the Chill Factor and um, then I have to have my dinner. I've got things to do and I can't remember them right now, so I have to write them down. Um, so we have our fuel cell with us today that's got lots of snacks in there for my kiddos and myself so that, well, we are stopping because we're gonna be going to the chill factor. Anyway, we've got snacks in there in case they need them. I have my packages that I need to ship. She's got her bee right back. They've got their water bottles. I've got my hobo bee and my Erin Condren. I just put on sunblock, got my sunglasses, and we're ready to go all right okay so list of what I need to do made stuck on the outside of my Aaron Condon with an Ollie clip and now I'm gonna put this down here on my consult not up there I'm not gonna look at it look at it but it's gonna be right where I can see it so I know what I have to do when because seriously I've told you guys a hundred times I don't remember squat like I just don't so I'm like Dory like I can't remember squat diddly squat so there it is again, my list of what I have to do on top of my Erin Condren, and I do this every time that I go out, All right? Yeah. Okay, so first stop, UPS store. Two. Drop yeah, dropping that off. It's already got shipping on it. Um, it's a big one, isn't it? It's it is. the, the wrong piece for our car that my husband ordered. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah. here's your receipt. My receipt. Make sure you hold on to it until it gets there safely. If you lose that, we do not have record of that tracking number in our system, so we won't be able to help you get it back. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Receipt. Aaron Condren putting it underneath my Ollie clip. It's crazy. Back in the car now, ready to go on for thing number two. However, my children are whining for wasabi peas. So here we go. What are they? Zombie peas? Okay, you want something. Of course you do. So Coney Island fuel cell for the win. Woo! Woo! I want the wasabi. Okay, well you have to share the wasabi peas with your sister. This are little these are called Okay, you don't get wasabi peas. These are called little blue avocado reusable snack bags. And they're freaking awesome! You should go get them. I don't have an affiliate link for you though. Okay, there's wasabi peas for you. Don't spill any. 
Emmy, do you want... You can't have chocolate covered almonds. Those are mine. Um, I have yogurt raisins, uh, Botan rice candy. What? What? Why? Would you want, do you want your rice candy? Oh, there you go. Yes, you have rice candy in here too, but you're eating wasabi rice piece. Candy. Oh, she want rice candy. Do you know how to open your box? No? Like a box. I do. You don't need to open it because she's going to take, this one right there will take tack. She'll be like, I no. just want to make sure it's not poison. I'm not. It's okay. I, you okay, you do it because mommy can't do it one handed. All right. Well, I know that, but you're. Well, we put this on the wrong doing way. Doing that. I can't I shut it with one hand. Okay. My hand, mine. What? I get. Eating wasabi peas. Y you got to give the wasabi peas back. There we go. Wasabi peas are being candy. traded for so I'll open up mine. rice candy. And these are all things that we get at the commissary so that we don't have to go out and buy snacks. However, we are going to be going out and snacking out today when we go to... Dang it, where's the other one? The chill factor. Okay, here it is. There you go, I'm throwing it. Pow. Ow. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Also have some of those uh, sliced up baguettes in there as well. Okay. She's getting it for you. Okay, so I've already. What? What? It missed her. Trash. Trash. I have a trash bag. Hold on. <gasps> Look at this. I'm reaching into my purse for something that I have. Trash bag. These juggling balls. Don't judge me. Got another one. Washi tape. Come on. It's not. What are you talking about? It's Hermione's bag. It is, and it's got an extendable charm on it. I gotta find the end of my set piece. Okay, Rosie Posey set piece that is Akio trash bag. Akio trash bags. Trash bag. Okay, Rosie Posey set piece that has uh, our med kit in it and Lady Time needs and my daughter's black mask because my little one right there she gets migraines um oh that's something else i have to add on here because we're almost out of children's advil okay i'm gonna get myself situated add that onto my erin condren planner got my other things to do today and there we go so we here at the post office i went in there and stood for like five minutes of mine and then i realized i forgot to label the calling mailer idiot move. Okay. Reaching into my bag here. Sharpie with the small point and the regular one. It's a good thing to keep these in your wallet or in your purse at all times, especially if you are a frequent mailer. Post office is done. I have my receipt, which is going to go right underneath my Ollie clip. And I'm going to check it off of my list. Why did they give you receipts? Because you have to keep your receipts so that you can track your package and where it's going. They're not buckled in right now because I'm not leaving yet. So don't think I'm going to drive around with my kids unbuckled. Okay? Just, yeah, I'm not going to do that. Okay. So. What was so I saying? What? Okay. Next stop. So that we have to go to the bathroom. Yeah, oh yeah, she has to go to the bathroom like crazy mad. So our next stop is a Dollar Tree because I have to go there anyway. She has to go potty. I need scotch tape and packing tape. All right, let's go. The restroom's locked. My oldest just went to go ran, run and ask for the key. No, that's the key to the men's room. Yeah, it's the key to the men's room. Ew, don't touch it. Men's rooms are gross. Okay, the women's restroom is not in order because they lost the key, so we have to use the men's restroom. It's really gross. Pray for us. Here we go. Oh, this smells so raunchy. Hold on, baby. Hold on. Take my purse off. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. In my bag here. Whoops. Clorox wipes. I'm about to Clorox the hell out of this thing. Whoa. We survived, but just barely. Yeah. You okay? 
It was really gross, wasn't it? Mommy had to hold your legs up and everything. It was really bad. So now we've already washed our hands, but now we're gonna sanitize. We're gonna sanitize with the sanitizer. Whoops. With the sanitizer attached to my bag. We survived the trip to the Dollar Tree. There were no casualties. That bathroom was so freaking nasty. Chill and look factory. at me. And now we're going to the chill factory, but I'm so glad that I keep Clorox wipes in my bag because seriously, freaking ew. It's gone. Is it gone? What's yeah, gone? Someone picked it up. Aww. Yeah. Her little sticker. Oh, that's so nice of you, Lily. So nice of you. All right. So I'm putting my receipt right underneath my Ollie clip and I'm checking the Dollar Tree off and now we're on our way to Chill Factor! Are we excited? Yeah! Are you excited? I want to chill. We have finally arrived at Chill Factor. The girls are really excited. Oh boy, yeah. The girls are really excited because we've been looking forward to this all day. So... I have my receipt, which I am going to put underneath my Ollie clip and my planner. And the most important thing to have out here for these two girls, that are three girls that are in my bag, I mean my bag are A's wipes. They go right in the middle of the, uh, you don't need them yet, right in the middle of the table. So now I am going to sign off for about 30 minutes while I polish that off. Oh yeah, be jealous. The girls are inside going to the restroom before we leave. They've all used the wipes to clean their face and their hands. And <clears throat> before you're like, oh my gosh, they're in there by yourself. We know the owners is very safe here. We live in a very small town and there's nobody else in there right now. So while my girls are inside, because I'm about to go to a dentist appointment and I just scarfed down a huge bowl of ice cream or frozen yogurt, it was really good. Like really good. I got off my teeth. These are kept in my med and lady time pouch in Rosie Posey in my bag. I'm gonna floss. I have one little mini toothbrush left, but I'm not gonna waste it. Okay, so we have finished most of our running around. We are here at my dentist appointment. We are here a little bit early. And as you can see, you can't see over there, but my two tiny ones are sleeping. So it's just me and my gorgeous daughter. <laughs> my gorgeous daughter, Lily, here. Lily, <laughs> ew. So I'm gonna grab my Erin Condren planner and I'm going to grab my headphones out of my passy pod here. And I'm gonna listen to my audiobook. I have Dave Ramsey on audiobook right now on Apple. I, I keep looking over here, but it's right there. I have Dave Ramsey on my Apple iBooks right now. So I'm gonna listen to Dave Ramsey for a little bit. Lily, <laughs> and Lily's gonna do what she does here. And in just a little bit, we will go into the dentist and I will wake up the minions. It just sheared off. <laughs> oh, that hurt. Yeah. Yeah, I was. Like, I was. I don't eating. know if that was filling. Was it tooth colored? I mean, yeah, I it was, was tooth colored. Your tooth that actually <laughs> broke. Ow. I'm yeah. not gonna touch it. Oh God! Again. I'm say, not, don't touch it again. I won't. No. Okay. All we have to do is make you scream once, then we know. <laughs> Oh, on that baby? Yes. Yeah, pretty much all yes. of my teeth are filling. No, your mom does not have a lot of filling. <laughs> oh, oh. Not... I'm so sorry. See, these are silver fillings. Uh-huh. I just ate a big thing of uh, ice cream with my girls. Uh -huh. Huge, and I have no regrets, so I do apologize. Mm -hmm. Making faces at her, but she won't smile. Mm, look at that eyes. 
So I have in that silver bag right there, I have some color and cheaper crayons for them. But she didn't want them. We had to wake her up to come in here, so she's grumpy. So in all our running today, I forgot one thing to write on my to-do list. Hey girls, stop for a second, please. Let me just finish saying this real quick before we keep going. I am sending my very good friend in the UK, Catherine, I'm sending her a Blooming Romance Be Classy as a gift. And she, like me, does no longer have any children in diapers. So I'm actually stealing her change pad from it. Girls, stop. And I'm gonna make it into uh, two zipper pouches to send with her because I know she'll like that for all her little bits and bobs. So I forgot to put on my <clears throat> I forgot to put on my to-do list today to come to Walmart because that's the only thing we have here. We don't have a craft store to get some zippers. And that's what we're doing now. Whew, today has been a day, my friends. So I hope you've enjoyed this video since you've seen a little bit about how I use my bag and what's in my bag all day long. You have seen this girl in action. Um, there she is right now, my ride or die girl. Um, you've seen how you know how well my Erin Condon fits in there and how I use it every day. And here you see all of my receipts from today, um, as well as my sticky note with my to-dos on it. I keep those Ollie clipped on the front and then till I go inside and I will sit down and I will log everything and put everything where it belongs. Um, yeah, so I mean, that's pretty much it. You know, pretty much everything in my diaper bag, diaper bag, everything in my purse, I have a reason for to be there. Um, usually when I'm walking around and I'm vlogging, I use my super cool selfie stick, but um, today I didn't use it. Not really sure why, I just, I just didn't use it. Maybe it was just because I'm a pretty spontaneous vlogger when I'm making videos, so setting up my selfie stick is something more for if I'm walking around a lot of places or if we're gonna be out of the car for a while. And today we were in and out, in and out, in and out everywhere. So there really wasn't much need for that. But you know, so uh, you've seen me pretty much use everything that I have in here. Thank God I didn't have to use EpiPen or a med, med kit or anything like that. Um, trash bags, lots of wipes. Uh, chapstick for me, as you can see, my lips are really red. They actually hurt now because like an idiot forgot to put on chapstick before I went into the dentist and of course they stretch your mouth out and all that good stuff and now it hurts um, yeah so I hope you have enjoyed this day in the life of my jujubee hobo bee and um, I hope you will join me again for other future videos that are gonna be just like this and I do believe like a day in the life of my bags is gonna be a thing that I continue to do so if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel then please subscribe I'm glad to have you here and every single thumbs up and view on any of my uh, videos is really helpful to me and it just helps me know that you guys like my content so thank you very much and you guys have a great day Come on, shut up. You've seen me use my juggling balls real quick, so I'm gonna show you. I'm still learning, so I'm I'm still practicing. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, okay? I'm still in. Just a second, I can do this. One more try, one more try, and this is why we practice. Now to do it more than once. Okay.